Yes. Okay, we're going to do Christmas flicks, y'all. So hopefully you'll get some uh, wrecks or, or, you know, discover some things that you hadn't thought of or hadn't seen to watch while you're on Christmas vacation. But, oh, which that's one, too. Forgot about that one. Oh, Christmas vacation. <laughs> I did. But, okay, let's talk about the OGs, the old ones that we that we love, are some of our favorites. So my ultimate OG is... The holiday. That is your. You have I never been that movie, and okay. really, it's a it's a houses. But I love the story. I love the just the premise of it. It's just so sweet, and it it's just pro women. You know what mine you know? is? Home Alone. Oh yeah, that's which a, that's is OG. And isn't that's a OG. Christmas? It makes me think of my kids. Yeah, I could see because we were watching it. I love that. Well, and another now. I love Bridget Jones's Diary, which oh, yeah. it's not a Christmas movie per se, but it's a lot of it is set around the holidays kind of like and hard. it's very snowy <laughs> yes. and it's a rom-com. Yeah. So if you haven't seen them, there's three of them. Uh, Bridget Jones's Diary, I think there's part two, which has a name that I can't remember. And then Bridget Jones has a baby. Yes. And go ahead and watch all three of them because the fourth is coming out. You did tell me that. And I, I can't remember. Um, when we'll out. get, we'll get back to you about when it's coming out and on what it's streaming. Okay. So you'll be able to watch so you'll it. Be able to see it. So it's super cute. Just a cute rom-com. Um, Hugh Grant's in it, who we love. Yeah. And, and uh, so anyway, that's one. And another one I love that is not really a Christmas one per se is Little Women. You did tell and me. And it does, it's snowy and it, it there are some scenes of it around Christmas. Quite a bit of it revolves yeah. around Christmas. They come and go and back and forth. But both of those are kind of go women. <laughs> and type those, movies. Those are, and I those love are that. Good, like classic. Yes. Yeah, those are good. I'm and like, Little Women is so if you have girls. That's a fun it's one a to watch one. with yeah, them. Any any edition. The one with Susan uh, Sarandon is really good, which is an older one. Winona Ryder. Yeah, that that's a really one. good one. There's a more recent one uh, that Greta Gerwig did. I haven't seen that one yet. Oh, we went to the movies to see it. Did Me you? and my mom and who went? My daughter-in-law, my one daughter, Kennedy, book club Kennedy. I figured went. it was Kennedy. Okay, that we was went, We all went, but it, like the day after Christmas, we went. And it, it is very sweet and snowy and Christmas and gets you in the mood. Okay. So do you have any other OGs that you like besides Home Alone? You're not going to like mine. No. It's going to be Die Hard and Long Kiss Goodnight. Okay. You know, my I don't mom- think I've ever, ever seen Long... Who's in that? Long Kiss Goodnight. Um, Samuel L. Jackson, and I can see is it, it's a, What is it? Like a you shooting? You know it's murder. Okay, shooting. yeah. No. So my mom does murder not like mayhem. warm and fuzzy, y'all. My mom does not do warm and fuzzy. That's as Christmassy as she wanted to go. Now, she would do animated, right? Like, of course, we do Charlie Brown. We do The Grinch. We do those. Okay. But, which I'm okay with that. Okay. And my mom, my parents like the claymation. So, of course, we, every, like, All of those. Frosty. Okay. And, yeah, those. Oh, Love Actually. That's a good OG one. That's it, that it is it set is around kinda, Christmas, okay, okay. but it's very rom com y. It is. Another Hugh Grant. Um, there's a lot of people in that one. It's got so many storylines, but it's so adorable. You know, another one, Elf. Elf has become. Oh, like yeah. A, that's a good like a, That's an OG. OG type it is. Of, yeah, it Elf is. Has that's become, super cute. Um, you already said the Christmas vacation. Which yeah. You which about. my sister in law, they have that on like. 24-7. Yes. I mean, it's it, like on the I don't think I had, oh, sorry, Chelsea. I don't think I had ever seen the whole thing, but we were at her house and it, kept and going. it just kept going. And <laughs> it's hilarious. It is funny. It's so funny. It is funny. But it, yeah. So I have a few from Netflix and a few from Hulu, but they're not. Okay. Now give, okay. These, are they current? Kind of like within the yeah, last five, five years. years. Yep. Okay. What are those? Okay. So my Netflix one. Um, I have four for Netflix that I, I watch. Best Christmas Ever, Jingle Jangle. Best Christmas Ever. Were those the two gay guys? Was that it? 
Was it or no? Was that the name of that one? Oh, I gotta look. Best Christmas. I gotta look. I don't. Now. I don't know. Okay, I'm just trying sorry. to remember. Okay, I'm just putting. Down I'm the sorry. List. I threw. No, best Christmas ever was the one with Brandy. I don't want to give away what happened. Oh, you remember? Oh, yes, 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 yes. And so, guys, it's okay. Best just with Brandy. That's all you need to know. Christmas period ever. Okay, like, that was cute. Christmas. That was ever. cute. That, that was one cute. was cute. I think that was last year when we saw that, and that was good. Okay. Jingle jangle. Which, okay. if y'all know this, like Forrest Whitaker greases my peach, y'all. So when that I saw was him, sweet. My, it, my it grand was so good. Sugars like yes. that. Yes, Jingle that's Jangle sweet. is really yeah, good. That's very um, sweet. very upbeat. Not a sad one too much. Um, the holiday and people of color too. Yes, which yes. Th- those are few and far yes, between. They are. So yeah, with a happy story. Oh, I had holiday too. That was you know adorable. I love the holiday. That was cute. That's my little like. I don't feel good. I'm like holiday. And yes, I'm that's again. super sweet. And then love hard with my boy Jimmy. You remember oh, Love Hard? Oh, that's right. That was super cute. That was cute too. So those were my Netflix. Okay, I had a couple Netflix. Uh, Netflix. Okay. One was uh, Holiday in the Vineyards, which is a oh, rom-com. Oh my gosh, that's right. With, and um, um, I what's think her name? Christina Milian? No, uh, that's not her. No, no. It's it's people. I don't know. You've seen them, I'm sure, but we I don't know this. their names. They're not like, it's not this. super famous, but there's, it's a cute one. And I believe there's two. Might hmm. be three. I think it's two in this in kind of a series. Um, and a castle for Christmas, which is kind of very hallmark that, that it was on Netflix so, oh. and it's with Brooke Shields. Okay. So okay. I lo- I love seeing um not 20 year olds. Yes. You know, so yes. it's it's kind of inclusive, age inclusive. Okay. So I'm that's a that. really sweet one. Come on, Netflix. Um and Christmas in Notting Hill. That's so Which cute. is a Hallmark one, but it's yes. it's very cute. I love Hallmark. Okay, so there's some some that we want to see. Now okay. these I have not seen. Let me Which look. Ones? Um, there's a few guys we watched. One, oh no, this one I did see. It was on my two C list, and I just saw it. And it it's very cute. It's Christmas with the Sings. Oh, so it's a Indian family. What is this streaming on? Do you know? It's Hallmark. So okay. you probably could okay. get it on Hulu, Hulu. or Peacock or too. Peacock. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. But it was really cute. And the guy that plays in it, you guys know him. I don't know his name, but he plays, he was in uh, Virgin River. He's in Hallmark. So he's in a lot of stuff and he's cute. So you know him. So he's he's got the rom-com leading man, oh, you know, look. Okay. But it was such a cute premise of the... Um, the cute guy falling in love with the Indian American nurse, and then they get together, they're engaged, and just kind of overcoming those family things. Yeah. You know, we we do this for Christmas, but my family does this, and it, and it was so cute. So that's a good that one. Cute. Okay. Um, Christmas on call, I have not seen, but okay. it's on my list. Uh, Holiday Touchdown. Which is a Chiefs love story. So they hey, kind of okay. did, I guess they got inspired by Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. Holiday so, touchdown. So it's it's set in Kansas City, I guess, okay. and around the Chiefs. So a football okay. couple, I don't know. The fact that you want to watch this well, is doing it for me, what, y'all. I thought, what y'all know a, I can't get Lisa to watch thing. nothing with sports. Yeah, so it's set okay. in Kansas City. I'm about that. So if you're a football fan Who and rom-com, it? there you go. I'm going to add this to my list. Yeah, okay. but I'm, the I'm Sings watching. is super cute because okay. you never, or rarely, let me, I won't say never, but rarely do you see people of other ethnicities and other. Now this was interesting too, because he asked her, Oh, I thought you were Hindu. She said, no, my family is Christian, but my yes, mom's the family is yeah. Hindu. And I, I mean, that was interesting. Okay. Okay. Just, it, it was super cute. And it looks super Hallmark cute. y'all. Okay. I'm, I ain't ragging on Hallmark. Cause I love, if you, it, ooh, and if you're Hallmark. feeling some kind of way, Just ain't Hallmark. nothing better yeah. than chicken soup and a Hallmark movie yes, to I make you feel better. So I'm not, I am not getting on Hallmark, but Hallmark has stepped up their they have, game. Baby. They, they have better actors. Their sets are like, their sets are believable. gorgeous. The houses are different. They're yeah. very, they're very, we used, we used to watch a same, different story. In the same, same little house. farmhouse. <laughs> you know what I mean? They just changed. From like the, I've, I've seen this before. Yes. Yeah. So no, they just they're, everything up. is different. The actors are better. It's it, Hallmark has really done a phenomenal job the last couple Leveling of years. Up. They, have. they really have. I agree. So okay. okay, let's see. Do you have Hulu's? 
Um, well, those are that's all that's my yours? list. So I have a Hulu list too. So if you if you have Netflix subscription, I gave you some. So my Hulu list is these are current ones. Or, or yeah, these or, are all kind of current. These current. are not OGs. Okay. These okay. are like in the last like five six years. Okay, okay. If, you know, if not last year or two. Christmas with the Cranks. Okay. I love that. Yeah. Um, Santa Games, which is so... Okay, wait, let me fun. think. Wait, you know, OG Who's we didn't that? mention that's not family friendly, but like if you're doing like a little grown up, you know, eggnog situation, Bad Santa. Oh, when the kids are in bed. Yeah. Bad Santa, that's so funny. But Bad Santa is not. This it's is not for your not kids for, no. at all. It's grown Billy Bob Thornton is a fool. Um, Santa Games. He's a comedian. I'm trying to look because I... I can see Santa his face. Games. Yeah, it's and it's fun. on Hulu. It's on now? Hulu, okay. so you should watch it. I don't know that I've seen. I that mean, that's one. obviously not one to watch with littles, but it is good. Okay. Um, you know, his. I'm looking at him, guys. I have to show her because now it's going to drive me crazy. It's going to pop up. Jingle all the way. You know okay. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Okay. Phase on love. Come on. Okay. I, was like, I, I haven't seen that is. one. Okay, but that, that one's that's funny. Good one. Um, so. Christmas with the Cranks, Santa Games, Jingle All the Way, okay, and the Santa Stakeout. The Santa I Stakeout is that cute. One either. Okay, Natasha, she sees the actiony, funny ones. Which are those? That's not <laughs> really what I'm drawn know, to. Usually, my mama don't believe in. Yeah, she likes she mayhem believe in fuzzy. and madness. My mom, Christmas. if no one gets shot, she's like, "Why are we watching?" <laughs> I'm like, mom, it's I Christmas. need somebody's guts hanging yeah. out. Literally, that's so I can say you Merry know what? Christmas. If like Game of Thrones had a Christmas episode, <laughs> that that's would be my jam. Mom. She'd be yeah. like, "Now this is good Christmas." I'm like, mom, this, the kids are crying, and she's like, "I love it." So yeah, guys, I can't do just regular, but I do love Bad Santa. And that, before it is I had cute. kids, I used to watch. That was my thing. Okay, I would make Mexican hot chocolate. You know, I always make hot chocolate from scratch. So like, I'm I'm spending some time. I would pour it up. Loaded with my marshmallows because I was really half marshmallows, half cocoa, and I would watch Bad Santa. I have to watch different it now, guys, strokes for y'all. different folks, which, which is why we have a list so you can pick, you can pick what, what you, you want to see warm and fuzzy or madness and mayhem. Just saying. Up next, simple meditative affirmations at work, but first, a message from our sponsor. During hard times, it can get really difficult if you don't have anyone to talk to. Being alone with your thoughts can be an isolating feeling that can allow negativity to consume you. This is why we are sponsored by BetterHelp. BetterHelp is customized online therapy that offers video, phone, and even live chat sessions with your therapist, so you don't have to see anyone on camera if you don't want to. There is a broad range of expertise in BetterHelp's 20,000 plus therapist network that gives you access to help that may not be available in your area. You just fill out a questionnaire to help assess your specific needs, and then you get matched with the therapist in under 48 hours. Then you schedule secure video and phone sessions. Plus, you can exchange unlimited messages and everything you share is completely confidential. You can request a new therapist at no additional charge anytime. Join the 2 million plus people who have taken charge of their mental health with an experienced BetterHelp therapist. So many people use BetterHelp that they are currently recruiting additional therapists in all 50 states. Get 10% off your first month at betterhelp.com slash free for coffee. That's better com slash free for coffee. Okay, what is your quote? My quote is I radiate good health from the inside out. Dang, yours is so good. Okay. Which has nothing to do with Christmas. Movies. It doesn't, but then it okay. is it is a warm and fuzzy. Yes. And we need to think healthy thoughts during this kind of Time. cold flu COVID yes, season. season. Just saying. So I guess ours are like our movies. Yours is warm and fuzzy. And mine is be merry, be bright. Doesn't oh, that sound good. like something Samuel no. Jackson says before he shoots somebody? <laughs> be merry, be bright. No. <laughs> that's it's a done. good one. So yeah, that, no. that's a t-shirt. I think I have a pillow, merry and bright. You do. I do. Yeah. I don't see it. That's a pillow. Yeah, you know, I, I don't have it. Lisa's I have it somewhere else. Collection of pillows. Yeah. They're like stuffed animals. It like really, kids stuffed it animals. It is. She has at least 50. But I, I do the covers. So you don't, I mean, I don't have, you know, 50 pillows. You so you can just have pillows, a lot of you could well, I do have a lot of covers though too. You probably I got hate 100. y'all. You probably got a hundred. Because I'm like, you 
my oldest daughter guy, she's like, mommy, don't judge can me. Can we just get some pillows for my bed? And I'm like, you have pillows. No, like Aunt Lisa's pillows, mommy, the pretty ones that say stuff. I'm like, do you have Aunt Lisa money? Like, cause she's looking on Pottery Barn. I'm like, ma'am, get your ass to Target. Go to Target. Kirkland's is good. Target is good. I get pillows everywhere. I, I I'm not, can't I'm not, imagine seeing her in I'm Kirkland's. not choicey. I, Kirk, see, I see them and everywhere. Kirkland's is scary though. Yeah, that it's a overwhelm. Oh no, she, I would have no money. Oh, mommy, she we fine. need this. Yeah. Don't you love it? It's a, it's a it's a big experience. <laughs> it is a big experience. We're gonna we gonna wait another five years, please, Jesus. <laughs> okay, loves. Thank you for pulling up a chair and joining us for coffee. Please subscribe to Are You Free for Coffee podcast wherever you are listening. We hope that you enjoyed today's episode. Got a few holiday recommendations and find joy in the little things. Until next time, thanks, guys. Thank you.